In 2017, I made a trip to Tokyo, Japan. I put some time-lapse videos then on this channel that were of low resolution. And recently, looking at them again, I decided to re-edit the clips from the raw footages to bring you brand new content. Welcome to the land of the rising sun. There is a list of to-do sketches for me to check off here in Tokyo. But before I begin on the quest, I decided to start my day painting this cute little Honda Gyro, a three-wheeled scooter with a roof just parked right by where I'm staying. After completing the painting in good time, I headed for the metro system and there I made a sketch of the kiosk on the platform. I'm on my way to meet the team from Good Coffee at Don Aroma in Meguro City. Writer Vaughn spotted my book La Copy and wanted to meet me for an interview. Good Coffee is a site that introduces specialty coffee shops all over Japan and around the world. You can read the interview in that link that's provided in the description box below. What an amazing cafe, especially for a sketcher. This feels like a turn of the century type coffee shop with old school cash registers, furniture, coffee making tools, etc. I spent the afternoon there sharing with the good people from Good Coffee and making these sketches of the interior and a pretty coffee cup.
Another one of those first day must hit sketching locations is the famous crossing at Shibuya. This scramble crossing or diagonal crossing is the busiest in the world. Reports on the internet say that as many as 2,500 pedestrians can cross this intersection at a time on a busy day. I can't even imagine that number of people. And where best? To pedestrian watch is at Starbucks Cafe on the second floor of Tsutaya Bookstore. So when at Shibuya, cross. Got to do the walk at Shibuya. This is the ultimate coffee place for people watching for sure. I took about 75 minutes to make this sketch and enjoyed it thoroughly. Though at one point, I was wondering to myself when it was going to end. Epic spreads like these will take time to complete and it's a great way to exercise patience. Well, this wraps up day one in Tokyo. I hope you enjoyed the program. Tune in to day two where I explore the most famous fish market in the world. For now, ciao guys.